Hello Internet, my name is Max7238 and welcome back to the Tower of Purgatory. Second run, floor 5. Let's hop right into it. Oh, I see a light machine gun. Let's see if I can get a hold of one. Whoa there. Derringer. If I remember correctly, that should be the, uh, like, two shot gun. I'm a little surprised that I just picked that up. That. that if, if. No, I've gotta be wrong. I, that, there's no way I just picked up that weapon this early into the second run. There's no way. Now, you know, you, you guys know that now I have to go check on that. Let's see. Yeah, how much you want to bet this is actually a shotgun? Yeah, this is a shotgun. Okay. I was about to say. That really freaked me out for a second there. Think Dragon Claw. Uh, if I remember correctly, that's the highest version of the claw weapons. Okay, now that I have another torpedo... Well, they're grenades. I don't know why they call them a torpedo, but... You know. Let me... Place that on my arm instead. Homing missiles, claw, I don't need. Spare energy pack, I don't need. Hang on to that. I don't think I can do anything with my stats for right now. I'll throw some stuff into heat resistances for now. So, I'm, uh, I'm gonna make a new habit out of this. I'm going to start clearing rooms for 13 minutes of the episode. And then, for the other two minutes or so, or however long it takes me to fight the boss, I will fight the boss. <coughs> I will keep any, uh, new weapons that I find, uh, show off anything that I need to. That way, I've shown off the drop tables without showing a whole bunch of monotony. That is a lot of overheat. I apologize for that annoying sound. It won't happen again. Ah, come on, energy, please. Dang it. Okay, well, cooldowns work, because I have energy packs on my legs, so... Good enough for me. I am expanding my uh, inventory now. I'm trying to use um, some heat and impact. Trying to give myself some variety in the weapons that I can use. Because, to be honest, pure bullet against the real final boss just isn't going to cut it. And I know that. And even knowing that, I still want to try. So, the first thing that I'm going to do when we fight the real final boss is try him with completely, like, my old setup. I get it, you guys have homing missiles. Ow, 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 ow. Cut that out. Aha! I don't know why I do that, it just makes me feel better. I'm sorry. Evening out my weapons.
we've basically gotten to the point in the game where the design has fully taken over. There's nothing else to question. You know what your purpose is. And if you've gotten this far into the game, you know whether you like it or not. And whether or not you should continue. At this point, things have gotten very simple for anyone playing this game. Either you've seen most of the story, and you're okay with it, or you're fed up. And you've probably stopped playing. Which means, technically, you've probably stopped watching now, too. Is that a Gatling cannon? Dang it! That is not only a Gatling cannon, he has advanced repair systems. Hand him over. Well, I got the advanced repair system, but I didn't get the Gatling cannon. Listen, bud, all I want is your Gatling cannon. Well, I don't think you have Oh, no, you have one too. Come on. Come on. Dang it. It's gonna be one of these floors again, isn't it? Okay, you're the bigger threat. Uh, the overheats. I'm so sorry. I know it's an annoying sound. Alright, help me out. Help me out by breaking these, please. Thank you. There we go. Alright. Disable these guys and finish them off. Come on. Dang it. Oh, uh, <laughs> that new Gatling cannon would help so much. I want to get back to my old setup. Was that just two drops in one box? I feel like that was just two drops in one box. And I just picked it up so quickly I didn't even notice. Oh look, a cooldown. You know what that means? It means I can spam my attacks like crazy. I mean, I'm happy that we got the advanced repair systems, because that is going to help if I run into any trouble on a boss in the future. It's just, at this point, what I really need is equipment that I'm, like, weapons that I'm actually going to use. You know, or better armor, maybe. Just something different than what I've got on me right now. That is a heat axe. Acceptable losses. Yes! Light machine gun. Oh dear. Might as well. Okay, now we just sit here and wait for the whole thing to go insane. I might put in an annotation to just skip this or something. Wow, this is annoying. Whoa. Okay, let me be clear. It doesn't annoy me. This doesn't bother me at all. I don't mind this. But I know it's going to annoy the people watching. And there's nothing I can do to cut it out. Okay. Note to self, for the sake of the viewers, avoid heat axes. Who do you think you are? Alright, now we just get to sit here and listen to more of this crap. There we go. Seriously. It was awful.
Okay, that is either a very, very intimidating plasma cutter, or that is a guy from the first run. I'm going to use him to break open these boxes. And then... We're going to approach him and shoot some grenades at him. Okay, yeah, that's a guy from the first run. And for some reason, I can't hit him. No, he's not from the first run. Oh, no, yep, he is. That's just how badly my grenades suck in terms of damage. There we go. Rotating six mortars. Something something nagging at me tells me that is not the most powerful Gatling cannon. I'm probably wrong, and I'm probably just thinking of Rengoku 2, but still, it's there. Yeah, I have liquid cooling on right now, but you're uh, you're pretty screwed. That is heat sword. That is something else I would like to avoid. When the dust clears, we can see... Yes! Light machine guns. Light machine guns, please and thank you. Okay. Just one more room to go, so I actually don't need to cut the video this time. Oof, okay. Let, huh, let me sort this first. You know what? I'm gonna hang on to those stun guns. Don't need you anymore. Don't need you anymore. Not gonna use you. I'll be taking that. And I suppose I'll put one of these there. Throw that on there. Alright, this is sort of like my old setup. Alright, hang on, hang on. Before I make a mistake that I will very quickly regret, let's keep the armor and that's... Oh, that's because I put on the wrong thing. I was about to say, that does not look like a Gatling cannon at all. That doesn't look anything like what I remember. Oh wait, that's the Dragon Mortar. I'm an idiot. And I'll throw in the Dragon Mortar for funsies. I got pretty much everything I need on me already. And we are going to rearrange this so that the liquid cooler is on top, because if I don't do that and I run into this boss fight with all these ridiculous, ridiculous weapons on, bad things are going to happen. We don't want bad things to happen. Hang on to all this stuff. Okay. And that means that I can now also catch up my arms. Throw something in here. And not enough of the legs, huh? Alright. Looking a little strange, but mostly back to our old setup. Let me just save the game, fight the boss, and I'll cut out. Oh, right. Huh. Save the game and fight the boss. Forgot! One more room. How about no? Gonna have to go with no. Okay there, buddy. Oh, there's not just one room left. I bet this whole interior is all filled in, isn't it? We'll see. If the next room has a door in it, then I'll know, and I'll just cut the video there. Ooh! All the grenades forever on that guy. The 
if you'll notice, the uh, new T4 here that I've got on my head, um, as opposed to my old, like, what was that, the 762? Um, this thing shoots a lot more bullets. For each trigger pull. Okay, here goes. Yeah, this whole thing, this whole interior is going to be filled in. I'm going to cut here. Uh, Alright, I'm back. Let's finish off this floor and move on to the next one. Sphinx. Isn't that just good for you? Remember how we killed you last time? Yeah, we're gonna do that again. The Gladiator. Sword of the main character. And just like that, Sphinx is done. And just like that, we're on to the next floor with three entrances. All right, I'm going to cut it here. I'll see you guys in the next part. Thanks a lot for watching.